this is Stargazing Scotty. I'm Wendy and this is Scotty. We live full time in our scamp camper, which is at the present time in a driveway because of the coronavirus. Um, today I'm doing a little video on some of the not so nice realities of living full time in a very small space. Um, I choose to live this lifestyle mostly because of my income. Um, I receive $750 a month and because of that on disability uh, it makes it extremely difficult for me to have my own place and I also really care about the environment so Scotty is my service dog I have epilepsy and he goes everywhere with me he cut himself last night and had to go to the doctor and get some stitches but he's doing better today um, this is one of the realities of scamp camping <laughs> or any camping rain um, it rains quite a bit. The weather, it gets cold at night. Um, yes, the camper is somewhat insulated and it's better than most. But you're still going to freeze because the windows. So let me take you on in here and show you how we live. It took some, me some adjusting. At first I felt really cramped and now I just kind of love it. <laughs> but it, it wasn't like an immediate thing that happened. Um... This is our setup for right now because we can't um, go out. I haven't really figured out a place for the trash yet. But this is um, just some of the realities. You live in a very small space. So I try to keep it nice and clean. Wanted to show you little tips and tricks. I have all four seasons of my clothes down here. So I roll them like this. So that I can see what I have. That's all my summer shirts. Winter shirts are back in the back. And then I have all my pants. My hiking pants and rain pants for this season out. Um, pajamas go up here. And then my TV. When you are moving, all this stuff has to be packed up. Just the stuff that could fly away gets packed up in this basket here. Um, we a lot of shelving. Um, I had to add, and it feels cramped at first, but then you get used to it. But I mean, you know, it's not beautiful and pretty <laughs> like you see in all the things but it is a nice way to live and some of the year I have water most of the time I don't so Scotty and I drink bottled water my cupboards and cabinets um, hold on. everything has to have a place one little thing out of place can really set you off here's my coats and I keep my shoes down there and then I have a little basket for my tools back there. Some of my dresses. And now you can see the mess. I moved something in this so everything's everywhere. But I can always keep a steamer too. Uh, for depression. And But my clothes actually stay pretty nice when they're rolled up like that. Um, in this drawer is my coffee and tea. And then, in this drawer is Scotty's drawer with his treats and his bones and all the stuff that he needs. Uh, that's basically my junk drawer, which I'm when I'm working on the camper. And then, I have my pots and pans up here. And... My dish is up here. So, it is cramped. It is tiny. But you know what? We love it. And those pillows, you know, I take the, the two pillows off every night. And it actually gives me a, a very decent sized bed. Um, but I do leave them up here because on the nights, sorry, on the nights that it gets down 
in the 40s and 30s, sometimes in the 20s. Here, you get a decent sized bed out of this. But when it gets really cold, I need those pillows in the back. So that's one reason. Everything has a space. Everything in here has a purpose and a reason uh, to be here pretty much because my space, it's basically a six by six box. And like I said, at first I had a hard time getting used to it. But now it's home and the dog loves it and I love it. And then I can't. But I was lucky to be able to get the big bed scamp so that I could do this setup. And then I'm going to put a lagoon table in so that I can have a place to sit and eat. This always has to be here, Scotty's little perch, because it is a really, I didn't want him jumping down and hurting himself. So that's just a tour of, you know, how we live every day. It's not perfect and neat, but it's us and we love it.